So here's the, the sweat after 20 minutes running down here. Oh, it's a good day. Um, so if you remember last time I went through planks and decided, oh, I could do a little bit of crawling, I could do a bit of this. And before you get into all the crawling stuff, I think one of the most important things to figure out is how to set your arms. I think I'm getting steamy. So, uh, in 2014, I did the Kathy Grant training and uh, awesome training under Cara Risa. One of the things she talked about was keyhole arms, which then has sort of become a, a spiral for me. So a lot of the time when we do things, the shoulders come right up here. Yeah, really hoping this is the front of my screen. Ooh. And you're not, Mm. We'll see. As you see, very off the cuff, very natural, I'm trying to find the best light. So, planks and arms and knees, we can be a little bit up here, dropped, and wrists get um, sore. So, as you watch this, just find a surface and reach your arm forward. And I just want you to take your other hand out onto the top and you arm spiral, so your arm bone sits right up in there, kind of where my rose is almost, and that upper arm spirals that way. Now if you do too much, you'll see that my fleshy elbow points at you. Not good, hyperextended arms, so I'm going to keep that turned out, but as that turns out, the lower bit turns in without the upper following. So that's why we say it's an outward spiral, inward spiral. And what you'll get is a little bit more pressure on the thumb part of your hand, but not that your hand rocks or the hand turns in. So center finger, as long as your center finger is not broken and at an odd angle, point it forward. And then reach out of that arm, outward spiral, in a spiral. And what I sort of, as I come forward, what I tend to see is that the angle that this makes almost points in the same direction as my thumb if my thumb is spread. Yeah, so that's hyperextensive. And then when I keep that upper arm that there, there, then I turn my lower arm in. And from the side view, where you see that's collapsed, that's lifted, that's rolled forward. Turn that upper arm out that little bit and you'll see the tricep. Kick in the lower arm spirals in and now my arm is really set so that when I come into all my planks and things, if I keep that spiral, it's not in the wrist, it's up in the body, core connects into that, and we have good arm positioning. Oh, I look so red, don't I? Um, the beauty of off the cuff videoing, welcome to East Coast Park if you've never seen it before. I'm Lisa Jones, and you can find me on Lisa S. Jones Move on Instagram. Um, website is coming. See you later.